Hello Beginner Saxes. These are two more pieces that we can use as repertoire from the public domain. And that's because they're written by a Hungarian composer named Bela Bartok, who died in the middle of the 20th century. And therefore his work is in the public domain now. So he's written a lament and a maypole dance. Lament is means a sad song. Maypole dance is there's a European tradition where they put up a large pole and they attach coloured ribbons to them and people do a special dance and weave the ribbons around the pole. It's all very, I don't know, it's very spring actually. So, of course, uh, May here is not spring, but it often feels like celebrating, you know, the, because the rain has come. So we could we could do maypole. We can if we want. All right. So there's a sad one and then there's a, a much brighter and livelier one. Do please download the, the print copy from the Connect Library and the audio file onto some device you can play it with because the Maypole dance, basically you play the same thing three times. But what Bartok did, that's quite clever, is he's given you a slightly different harmony for it each time in the accompaniment and that changes the sound of it each time. But they do, they're both, in, so they're both in the minor key and you know I've said to you that it's a bit of a cliche to say that the minor is always sad. The maypole dance is very, very much a happy minor key song, whereas the lament really is trying to be sad. And one more warning, the lament can feel odd because it has odd timings on the phrases. We've got one, two, three, four bars that you play and then one bar that you rest. One, two, three, four bars you play, one bar of rest. One, two, three, four, five, six bars you play, one bar of rest, two bars you play. So we have a lot of fives and sevens going on, which is very Eastern European, but not so much our tradition here. So have, a, have an exotic moment there. Here's at the lament. Mm hmm. <laughs> If you're playing with the accompaniment, it's part of the fun of doing it is that you get softer and softer at the end and then whammo at the last minute. Um, 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 register changes, lots of fun things to do. Okay, if you've not been used to preparing a longer piece, the trick with a fast piece is practice slowly until you're getting it on your fingers, then practice medium. You can chunk it, you can do two bar chunks all the way through. That one does run in two bar phrases, so you're okay with that. Okay, so... And the good news is, once you've learnt one repetition of the tune, you've, you've got a free ride for the next two. Okay, enjoy. <laughs> 